The bathroom ceiling in Phuong Sao was damaged, and the water pipes broke during the blizzard. Within a few days, a Vietnamese plumber came and helped her fix them. Vietnamese people are always willing to help each other during tough times. For example, the plumber immediately came to fix our water pipe after I called. He was also willing to give me any tools or building materials needed to fix my house. I'm very grateful for that. Dad and some of his friends who have experience in construction decided to assist people by fixing houses and water pipes that were damaged by the blizzard. The activities were widely shared on Facebook just a short while after it was posted. I also included our company's number so that people can contact me and my friends. We will come and help them fix their houses or water pipes. We just need them to pay for the building materials. I received nearly 100 calls on the first day. Roads were covered with snow and ice after the blizzard, slowing the traffic. Building materials are also in short supply due to the increasing demand for house repairs. However, that group still managed to fix over 25 houses within four days. I'm very lucky that my house wasn't affected much and I still had electricity and water. Before the blizzard, I would get back home from work at around 5 to 6 p.m. These days, I help others fix their houses, so I get home around 8 to 9 p.m. This is just a small work. Many others have joined hands so that the Vietnamese community can overcome the consequences of the blizzard.